Okay, here's a neat thing that I learned from Mitch. Um, God, a couple years ago, I haven't been practicing it, but I'm starting to implement it now. I thought I'd share it with you. It goes like this. It's uh, I'm not really sure what it's called. It's major triads. I'm gonna illustrate it in uh, in a single key, in a, you know, diatonic key in C major. And we're gonna start on F major uh, because it's got it's the lowest note without open strings on the instrument. So we're gonna play root five and then five again and then the third. So we're gonna be playing the sixth string, the fifth string, the second string, and the first like this. And you got F. C or root five, C again on the B string here, and then uh, A, which is the third. So it's got a real wide, I don't want to say sweeping because that's not really what it is, but it's uh, it's big. And then here's G, same exact shape because they're major triads. So. The way I've been practicing them, or starting to practice them. Obviously, you know, talent's a dull knife. you got to keep it sharp. So if you don't practice them, you're going to sound crappy. And there's minor. A minor is the sixth chord in the key of C, and it's a minor triad. So root 5, 5, flat 3. It has a slightly different shape. A little easier to play because it's not as much of a stretch. You got the B diminished. It's a little more of a stretch. Root flat five, flat five, flat three. Or B, F, F, D. C major. Same shape. D minor. E minor. We're back at F major. We can keep going. G and A minor. So if we put it over music. Wish me luck, because again, I'm just starting to implement these into my playing. As you start to see them while you're looking for ideas, once you get good at them and you pull them off, they sound killer. Mitch does this stuff, and for those of you who've seen Mitch Shamara play, and I'll put his name in the description, I mean, he does the most incredible stuff, and he's all over this kind of thing. If you can get them fast, then they'll kick ass.
And of course you can skip, you don't have to go in order, but I'm trying to think about implementing and it makes it hard. So I'm gonna go from F to A minor to C major to D E minor to G. You can go the other way, of course. That's cool. So from C to A to F. And resolve it to G. That's cool. Have it. If you have any questions, message me and I'll uh, give you more info.